This must be the sandstorm. Fortune for you to venture so far for treasure already claimed. You would do well to leave, that I may collect what is by rights mine. You think the proto relic is yours? Proto what now? Relic, you say? Ha! Ah, a ridiculous name, unworthy of my treasure. What you names covet is none other than a prize in my resplendent arsenal. The get uh oh. Oh. This form! I can hold it no longer! Oh, 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 down I go! Oh, what was that? <sighs> oh, thank goodness I finally got through. Are you all right? I'm fine. But what the hell was that just now? I'm investigating the matter as we speak. In my initial analysis of the sand entity, I detected a proto-relic-like signal. I'm unsure how they're connected, but I fear we might be after the same thing. Of course we are. There's no telling where it might appear next. Please, be careful. It's some sort of monster's den. A fortress, if you will. Whatever it is, I don't think we can get inside. Huh. scan. I believe I have a match. The symbols resemble those found in the Book of Kings, an ancient tome. Allow me to translate. Hmm. Interesting. Well then, in order to unlock this door, you'll need to locate a cactuar rock hidden somewhere in the desert. What kind of rock? A mineral deposit named for its distinct cactuar shape. Now that Cloud has made contact with this door, the rock we seek should be marked by a green glow. By the way, do you happen to see a cactuar shaped statue anywhere nearby? Uh... Oh! That's it! That statue should guide you to the rock I spoke of, which in turn will serve as the key to the door. So we must prove ourselves worthy. I know you can do it. Oh, man, that was hilarious! Hey, 
You think there are any more of these amazing rocks out there? Our pliability is most impressive. Whatever. Let's go. Treasure of the sands, it seems, which they have kept safe for generations. Moreover, they are duty bound to ensure its safety until its rightful owner comes to claim it. Wonder who that is. Hmm. For all we know, it could simply be a myth. You're saying these guys have their own fairy tales? Sounds pretty silly to me. Hang on a sec. Who are you calling a fairy? Oh, no need for all that. Name's G, Kid G. Descended from a long line of goblins. I look after these cactuars. It's a duty passed down to me from my forebears. Wait, you can talk? <sighs> Speech ain't that hard, lady. Where there's a will, there's a way. Given your present company, I'm shocked you haven't shaken that preconception. <laughs> he does have a point. Quoth Cactuar Scripture, the Book of Kings. Unto those who seek the treasure of these sands, a trial shall be given. <laughs> if you think you've got what it takes to be the treasure's rightful owner, you're gonna have to prove it first. Where'd they all come from? And now your trial. Take down the cactuars within the time allotted. If you can. Oh, it looks like we have ourselves a volunteer. Who? Oh, me? I got what's coming to you. You gonna hand over the proto relic then? Hmm? Never heard anyone call it that before. But I'm a goblin of my word. So here. And so, as promised, your piece of the prize. Piece? We want the whole thing, Shrimp! Then you're gonna need to go around and gather up the other bits. Put it together yourself. Right. So what you're saying is... That more trials await. And that yours truly will be your guide. See you next time. What an unexpected and exhilarating turn of events. An ancient treasure guarded by an army of cactuars and a goblin. Not to mention the mysterious giant of the sands and the Book of Kings. Huh. Increase in body temperature detected. I believe I'm rather excited. <laughs> I've already picked up another signal from the Proto Relic. Or rather, the Treasure of the Sands. Head for Modular Reactor 2. Say, how many of these mini reactors are there anyway? Several. These modular Mako reactors were erected throughout the desert as a means of generating and supplying power to the Gold Saucer. To avoid accelerating the desertification of the region, the reactors are periodically cycled between active and dormant states. Who would have thought all that glitz and glamour came at such a high cost? In any case, the reactors have been ingeniously repurposed by the Cactuars, and within these fortresses, they may secure their treasure. I honestly doubt Shimmer could produce anything half as resilient as this combination of sand and cactuar nectar. <laughs> <laughs>